Hi guys, today I want to show you how to root, how to install custom recovery and how to flash custom ROM on your Samsung Galaxy S7 or S7 Edge. I'm Martin Wise and let's get started. But first of all, warning, only for Exynos models, you will lose your warranty, you will lose all your data, you might break your phone, and I'm not taking any responsibility for broken devices. For routing purposes, download all four files on your PC first, links in the description. Copy TWRP and Odin into one folder on your PC. Now you can extract Odin. On your phone, go to Settings, Software Info and press 7 times on Build Number for Activate Developer Options. Now go back to Settings and on the bottom you should see Developers option. Go into it and turn on OEM Unlock. Good to go! You are ready for power off your phone. Now you need to boot into download mode. Press and hold volume down, home and a power button together for a few seconds. And volume up right now. Connect your device into PC. Remember to use an original USB cable. Launch Audi. The blue rectangle should pop up. If not, you need to install Samsung USB drivers on your computer. Now, press AP and load TWRP tar file. In options, just tick F reset time. So now you are ready to press start. Just wait a few seconds until you see pass. Disconnect phone from your computer. Now, power off your phone by pressing and holding, volume down, home and a power button until screen goes dark and volume up home and a power button straight away to put into recovery mode swipe right to allow modifications now go to wipe and format data wait a couple of seconds and when it's done, you need to reboot back into recovery. Connect phone back into PC and copy SuperSU and NoVerTie op encrypt zip file. You can now install SuperSU. Press install and choose your SuperSU zip file and swipe right for install. Done. At last, but not at least, you need to install NoVerTie opt-encrypt zip file. Exactly same way like before. Good job! From now on your phone has got root access and custom recovery. Now you can stop in this place and enjoy fully rooted device. Or you can go further up by flashing custom ROM. If you wanna carry on, just follow these steps. First of all, visit XDA developer website for custom ROM designed for your phone. All links you can find in the description. I have S7 Edge, so I will go into S7 Edge to read. Let's say I will take this one for example. You can read description about this ROM and when you're happy with it, find section where you can download this custom ROM on your PC. 
I downloaded one before, so I can carry on with my tutorial. So copy zip file with your custom ROM into your device. And it's time now for flashing custom ROM into your S7 or S7 Edge. So press install and find zip file with your ROM. Just open it and in many occasions a ROMA installer should pop up. So just follow instruction on the screen. Choose apps what you want to be installed on your device. And at last, press install. And after a few minutes, you can reboot your phone. Now the phone should prepare for first use. It's take a while, up to 15 minutes. You are ready now to do first setup and enjoy fully rooted S7 or S7 Edge with custom ROM. Thanks for watching. Watch my other videos, please. Like, share, and subscribe my channel. In next video, I show you how to unroot, unbrick, and back to stock on your Samsung Galaxy S7 or S7 Edge. That was me, Martin Wise. See you next time.